Okay, so everyone, I, good morning. <laughs> Welcome to our Gray House Vlogs. It is Monday, President's Day, but I'm still gonna be working today. I'm not taking off. I have things to do. In fact, today is the first day that Porch Swing, which is a new restaurant in Mesquite, they open up today, and I'm gonna go to that grand opening thing. I'm gonna go run by the HOA that I helped manage. I was looking at the time to see where I was with the time. I'm gonna go to the HOA that I managed because I need to check out, somebody has a storage pod unit thing in front of their house and they're not allowed to. So I have to call and find out about that, just double check that it's still there. And I was looking for Sox's um, vet records that he has at least his initial eight week shot because I need to take him to the vet because I think he has maybe, I don't know, this sounds gross and I really don't wanna say it, but I think he has like maybe worms or something. He was dragging his bottom after he went to the bathroom and his poop really stick. oh. So there was a loud crash and they knocked over their, their toy. Okay, so um, I had to take him to the vet, but I have to show his shot records before taking him. So, you guys, quit quit knocking stuff over. Anyway, and I can't find his shot records, so. I know I have them, and I found captains, but I just don't know. I remember seeing them. I just, in fact, I just, like, a few weeks ago, registered his chip, so I know I have the records, I just don't know where I put them to for safekeeping. <laughs> it's so safe, I don't know where I put them. Okay, all right, so that's what I'm gonna do, but first I'm gonna get a hot chocolate, because I want one, and it's cold outside. It's only gonna get up to like 47, which I know, I know, if you're not from Texas, you're like, uh, that's like shorts weather. But here in Texas, it's not shorts weather. It's bundle up in a parka weather. And that sounds like a lovely idea. I wish I could just stay home. All right, so let's go have some fun today. Also, as I'm shutting out all the lights and leaving the house, my sweater kind of smells like cake batter. Not that I'm mad about it, but I don't know why, because I'm like, like where was I that I smell like cake batter and I don't remember it. I mean, if there was cake, I'd remember. Side note, still haven't left. So the cats always want to come into the room because it has carpet. They don't necessarily like scratch at the carpet or anything, but they always want to explore in here. And so I'm like, okay, I'm looking for this piece of paper for socks. I'll let them in here. And then like seriously, like in two seconds, I found the paper. But I'm gonna let them explore and sniff and smell. And then I'm gonna go get a hot chocolate. Hey you guys, I just did a lot of paperwork at the office and so now, feels brighter out here for some reason, I don't know. Anyway, so now I'm gonna run home and drop off my laptop, drop off my bag, and then pick up socks and take him to the vet because he's got the little poo-poo problem and we need to get that resolved. And I'll pick something up for lunch because I haven't eaten yet and I'm a little bit hungry. So that's what we're gonna do now. Another stop at the house because the plumber's here now. So let's see what they're getting up to inside. Looks like they're getting all the plumbing and stuff put in, the fixtures. See, we've got faucets. We have toilet right there. It's not working yet, but it's in. And they're starting to put it, you really can't see. But they're starting, oh well, let me show you. There's where the shower head's gonna go. And then they've got the turn on right there. So that's cool. And like I said, they've got my faucets. Oh, they look so nice. So happy. Electrician's not here yet, but the plumbers are putting in the faucet for the island, the kitchen island. It's looking nice. See? That's the guy that put in, I think. I don't know. Oh, and they're getting ready for my bridge to go over there, so. Cool stuff. Socks and I are at the vet. Socks is in his carrier. Fixing to let him out, but um, haven't been back to this vet since Wolf passed away, so. Hmm. But it's, um, Socks needed to be seen. 
uh, just for a well visit in his first visit, but also because he may have some like issues, worms or whatever. So we need to make sure that that's taken care of and that he stays healthy. So that's what we're doing right now. And they have a cat waiting. This, this vet has a cat waiting area. So like you don't have to be by all the big dogs and stuff. Although he's not really like nervous, really. He's just more cuddly. He just likes to really cuddle. So I know I'm fixing to let you out so we can cuddle. Yeah, you hear him? Say hey. Say hey, I wanna get out and cuddle with my mom. Hey guys, it is almost 10 o'clock and I'm fixing to go to bed because I wanna get up at a good time tomorrow so that I can finish straightening up the house because the appraiser's coming and I want everything put away. I want everything looking neat and tidy inside and turn on the Scentsy so it smells nice in here and set up the crate for the cats to be in while the appraiser's here so that they don't get in the way and they don't try to get out. It's also supposed to be raining tomorrow. So again, another reason why I want the cats put away so nothing happens to them. We did take socks, we, I took socks to the vet today and he got an overall good bill of health, clean bill of health. Not even sure how to say that. He's basically a healthy kitten, um, aside from the possible parasite or worm issue, um, which is common, she said, uh, or common-ish. And so, um, clearly my allergies are like just on full blown. We're going to cause Lisa all kinds of problems. Anyways, so she gave him a pill and then we were supposed to collect a stool sample. Well, if you know me, you're gonna be surprised. I did it. I actually did it. He was going poop. I got the little container. I scooped, I scooped it up. <laughs> but I did it. I was gonna actually oddly proud of myself for doing it. But I collected the sample, which I'll drop off in the morning. And so just to make sure that we gave, I mean, we gave him the right medicine, but we gave him medicine for something and it wouldn't hurt him for him to have it. But if he has a different kind of thing, then he needs a different kind of medicine. Anyways, who cares about that? So he sucks. Uh, he's feeling fine. And tomorrow the appraiser is coming. So I'm going to have to set up the crate. I'm going to have to put all the stuff away because I just want to look at neat and tidy in here for the appraiser. It's also supposed to be raining. So that's going to be awesome. And I thought, oh, I thought tomorrow was the Perry Holmes uh, like thing. That's where they're giving the first 75 agents a Tiffany present, something from Tiffany. And I'm like, oh, say I wear this Tiffany necklace every single day. So I was like, oh, I want the Tiffany necklace because when they were giving out the Kendra Scott earrings, I missed out on it because I had the flu. Next time I'm going, y'all all gonna get the flu because I'm gonna get my earrings. No, not really, I wouldn't do that. But my allergies are just like kicking my butt today. Did I already say that? I don't know, I feel like I'm rambling. Um, I'm going to put up the Bells toy in just a minute because 10 o'clock's not the time to be playing with the toy. <laughs> that makes noise. Thanks, socks, but he's having fun. So tomorrow, the only thing I have tomorrow now I thought I was gonna have like this jam-packed day. So I'm gonna go drop off the poop sample. <laughs> go me, <laughs> fun times. And then I am gonna go to work and get some stuff done. And then at noon, I have the Economic Vitality Committee I'm on has a meeting, so I'm gonna go to that. And I did not have to do any research. I thought I had a research project for that committee, but apparently no. So I'm like, <laughs> Man, I'm getting all this free time. I thought I was gonna have to be doing all this research. Anyways, then after that, I don't really have anything to do. So, I mean, I have stuff to do, but I don't have like something to do or somewhere to be or something like that. I am going to try to stop by a couple area merchants tomorrow and see if they have any Valentine's, you know, stuff that's on clearance and uh, start looking for some things for the new house. Because um, in, I know this is probably gonna sound weird, but in my master bath, I kinda want one of those line drawings, you know? Not of like a nude sketch. I mean, 
taste of a nude sketch. Uh, I'm not even talking about a nude sketch, but just like an outline. It's kind of hard to explain. It's on my Pinterest. So if you follow my Pinterest boards, Our Gray House, then you kind of see what I'm talking about. Um, and then for the other bathrooms, I think I told you guys this yesterday. I was trying to decide what to do with the powder room bathroom. Like, do I want to put like a funny story thing in there? If you, if you watched my video yesterday, you'll know what I'm talking about. If you didn't, then go watch my other video. Um, but I don't know what to do in my office bathroom. I just wish I had a designer that I didn't have to pay. So if you're a designer and you want to just like give me ideas for free, DM me or, you know, comment or send an email to lisa at ourgrayhouse.com. I'm just saying. I do have a couple friends that might be willing to help though to kind of build up their portfolio. So I'm going to reach out to them and just say, hey, what would you do with this space? And where would you find the pieces? Because not only is just the idea and of how to decorate, but like also where to find it. Like, because it's like, oh great, you need this desk. And I'm like, okay, where, where, do, I, where do I get it? Because the reason I'm saying this, I found a end table or coffee table I mean up at quality furniture the other day remember that round one but that that's the wrong color yeah that one so I want to find that but in a different color so yeah and it's like you think okay I'll go to birchlane.com I'll go to Kohl's I'll go to I'll go to Overstock which I haven't looked there yet but um or I'll go to like and I'm trying to think of all the places where that might possibly sell stuff I'm looking for so I need to write down like a list of all the stuff that I want and need and then start sourcing it and yeah it's a lot it's a lot but it's fun this part is a little more fun than like the picking out the knobs and the picking out the other stuff because then it's like I don't know some of the decisions that we had to make I'm just like okay can somebody else just just make some decisions please like just a few of them take that off my plate but we're winding down, getting down to the nitty gritty. That always reminds me of uh, HQ, which I don't play anymore. But anyway, okay, I'm gonna go to bed. It's late and I've been rambling for almost nine minutes, 10 minutes, I don't know. Maybe not that long, maybe six minutes, I don't know. It's like saying nine minutes, but I think I started taping before I started taping, so anyway. I'm gonna go to bed and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Also, I need to find a better way to end my video because I'm like, bye. And it just, I just look silly, so.